Howdy gamers, Patrick Hickey Jr. here, Editor-in-Chief of RevueFakes.com, bringing you the next edition of Gemmer Junk. This week out, we're going to be playing Spider-Man 3, Invasion of the Spider Slayer. So, um, this was a kind of at my, the end of my Game Boy era, I would say. Like, the end of my 1993, I mean, wow, my... A button isn't working? There you go. Okay. There you go. Oh! Um, so this is like at the end of my Game Boy run. I mean, I was still playing Game Boy games by 1993, uh, but not nearly... Not nearly as much as, um... As I would. Let's see. Wow, people are crazy in New York. This is like Queens back in the day. These guys just pulling out guns and stuff. These people with knives. This game doesn't control well. How do I stick to walls? Ah, there you go. There we go. I mean, visually, I love the pixel art in this game. Like, this game is pretty sexy in terms of pix pixel art goes. So you have to, like, beat all these guys? Like, what the hell is going on here? Do I have to talk to this guy? What am I looking for exactly? There you go. Enemies just keep... Popping up out of nowhere, I guess. There's like spiders popping out of the sky. This is a weird one. This is very weird. The thing that I liked about Spider Man 1 was how intuitive it was. How you just kind of like jumped into the action. People just pulling, in, pulling out guns. It's like Bernard gets in the New York City subway. Collision detection is awful. What's the point of this level? I see there's a spider there. I'm kicking this guy. Yeah. I don't know what the hell is going on here. And I don't want to pull a Dean Takahashi and say that it's the game. It's definitely not the game, just I don't know what I'm supposed to be doing here. Again, I love the pixel art. The music's cool for a Game Boy game. And there's like these, these spiders are jumping out of like nowhere. Wow, I'm at a total loss. So I don't. Even, this is like one of those games that I cannot say for sure if it's gem or junk. I mean, this is definitely something where I would have to read like an online tutorial. And my whole thing is, it's just like for a Game Boy game in 1993, this should be pretty straight ahead. Like, why? Why is it this hard? Why is it this hard to kind of like know what's going on? What's this thing up here? It's like a. It's like the shortest level in the creation of level creation. Alright, I know I can shoot webs now. The spider hurts you. This is weird. This is so weird. Yeah. Alright, I'm gonna have to say, before I drive myself crazy, I really don't, I'm not a fan of the two enemies on the screen. Like, just the same two enemies over and over again. 
But again, it is a Game Boy game, but whatever. Wow. So yeah, gem or junk? I don't know. I'm dead. Crazy. This is insane. So yeah, I'm gonna say junk.